One function transformation that we can do is a vertical stretch or shrink. And this uh, we see in the function when we see a number uh, being multiplied by uh, the function. Now, we are only going to consider the cases where this number is positive, because if it's negative, we're going to break it up into the negative portion, uh, which is a reflection, and then uh, whatever the, the positive version of that number is, which is a stretch or a shrink. So if we're multiplying by a number, uh, there's two different cases. The first is if that number is greater than 1. Um, and if we multiply by a number greater than 1, that makes uh, well, whatever we have here bigger. So this is a stretch, a vertical stretch. We stretch the graph of f of x vertically by a factor of c. So, for example, if we had a, a 2 in front of uh, the function, then we would stretch everything by a factor of 2, meaning every y-coordinate um, is doubled. If you have a number uh, between 0 and 1, then when multiplying by that, we get smaller. And so that's a vertical shrink, um, again, by a factor of c. So if that number is, say, 1 half, all of our y values get cut in half. So if we have something like this for, uh, for c greater than 1, then we might um, have a function that looks, I don't know, you know, something like this. Um, and uh, obviously, this is just a quick, quick oh, that was really bad. Um, something like that, okay? Uh, that would be like a vertical stretch.